Hello everybody and welcome to Gadget's X-Ray. Today I'm going to show you how to play PSP games with a PlayStation controller coming up after the intro. All right, so first we need to head to Cydia and look for sources and then click on edit, add and type in the following link. You will find the link in the description. All right, so now let's get in packages and choose the first one, the developer latest one and install. Confirm. And return to Cydia. Now let's search for controller for all, which allow us to connect any Bluetooth controller, like PS3 controller. And then let's install it and confirm. Mm -hmm. Okay, so restart. Okay, now we need to set up the iPad with the computer. Let's hook our controller and then the iPad to your Mac or PC and then download the file from the description and pair. Once we are paired, we are ready to rock and roll. All right, now on your iPad, launch the emulator and click on power on your controller. We should see a red light. Okay, it's still connecting. All right, we're connected. So now we can navigate with the controller and choose the game that we want to play. This is Tekken 6. I never played this one before, but let's uh, give it a try and see how it will um, work. If your iPad is newer, um, I'm not sure which iPad work the best, but this is iPad 2 Retina Mini. Let's, uh, let's play a little bit. This seems to be very uh, responsive. There is almost lo no lag. And to achieve that, I suggest you go to graphics and look for frame skipping and activate auto frame skip. And then on controller, just disable on screen touch controller because we don't need that. We already are using the controller. I like the PlayStation 3 controller is the, my favorite controller of them all. It seems to be working in every device. Hope you guys like this video. If you would like to see more, please subscribe. See you later.